Hey kids! In today's video, we'll be talking about gerbils. Are you ready? Let's begin! Gerbils are mammals and are from the same family of animals such as rats, mice, guinea pigs, and hamsters, which is the rodent family. There are believed to be over 100 different species of gerbil in the wild. They are found in the wild in desert areas across Asia, Africa, and India. They are territorial creatures. They use a scent gland which is located on their chest to mark their territory. They do this by rubbing up against an object with their chest. Their color depends on what kind of species of gerbil they are. These colors are golden agouti, black, Burmese, light red fox, and shimmel. In the wild, they dig underground burrows so they can shelter, store their food, and keep their children. These burrows can go down as far as 6 feet deep underground. Gerbils have teeth that are always growing. Because of this, they have to find ways to cut them back, and the main way to do this is to chew things. They have kidneys inside their bodies that help retain as much water as possible. This is because they come from hot places where there isn't much water at all, so they have to keep as much water with them as possible. Baby gerbils are born blind, deaf, and without hair. They are omnivores, which means they eat fruits, nuts, seeds, and some insects. If you see a gerbil eating their own poop, this is quite normal, as what they are doing is absorbing the last nutrient left in the first digestion. Their hearing is very sensitive as they use it to sense when a predator is approaching. If you have a gerbil as a pet, it is more often than not a species known as the Mongolian gerbil. Its proper scientific name is Meriones unguiculatus. Their scientific name is roughly translated as the clawed warrior. The story of how the gerbil got its name, the clawed warrior, is that the Emperor Genghis Khan, who was a leader of the Mongol Empire from 1206 to 1227, was sleeping one night, and an assassin broke into his quarters with the intention of killing him. A gerbil apparently bit the foot of the assassin and caused the assassin to let out a shout, which then woke the emperor. The emperor was able to prevent the assassin from killing him, and after realizing what the gerbil had done, adopted the gerbil as his own, giving it the nickname, the Clawed Warrior. And that is all for today's video. I do hope you enjoyed today's video about gerbils. Well, take care now. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos from us, please click the subscribe button. Also, give us a like. That will help us. We thank you so much and we do hope that you enjoy our videos. See you soon.